Hi everyone, welcome to new series uh, regarding the Docker. I'm using ASP.NET Core and it's a step-by-step -step, uh, tutorial series. You can learn from, uh, it's a one kind of project-based series. Uh, first of all, I am creating a .NET Core application, then I'm moving to Docker step-by-step. -step. So what we'll uh, cover in this course, that is some theory about Docker, basic Docker command, uh, connect uh, docker with our application docker volume docker compose file uh, docker file for image building and deploy image in our azure registry and then we move to our uh, devops for docker build pipeline yeah, and then the release pipeline and i am the instructor for your and you can contact with me using mail github or uh, uh, linkedin any type of platform and then what topic I will cover and share this. First of all, I'm creating a .NET Core 8 application, uh, crude application. Uh, in application, we have a two part SQL uh, server and Redis, and then we uh, move to the Docker part. And second part is the introduction part for Docker. And here I will discuss some theory, theoretical presentation and then some we hands-on practice some basic docker command is a command list and then we move to connect our application with docker and this uh, this chapter 5 i will discuss with the docker compose how to create compose and uh, then we, we move into the docker file for create image uh, part 7 we introduce uh, docker image store as you registry uh, then we move to build pipeline for docker image and then the release pipeline and then we finish everything hopefully you enjoyed this course okay so next part we start uh, developing our dotnet core crude application bye bye